твою ж мать. So they, they're, asking they're asking me a question. Asking the question. They're asking a question. And what does that say, like in English, what does that say? It say that Crimea is not a piece of uh, bread and butter. Uh, in, in earlier, when, when, when the Crimean War began in uh, 2014, uh, in one interview, Navalny was asked, uh, can, you, uh, can you return Crimea or which country Crimea belongs to and he replied that Crimea is not a piece of bread and butter to discuss this topic like this but uh, it was taken it, out of context taken, yeah and after that he sev uh, several times he um, described his position and he was like absolutely anti-war uh, and uh, uh, in recent time when he was in prison he several times wrote about it that Crimea belongs to Ukraine Point. And if I can ask you just one more time, what does that mean, his loss to Russia? Uh, his loss to Russia is, this is the loss of uh, hope for brand new Russia, better Russia, the beautiful Russia of future, how he uh, called it, how he... Uh, so the Russia which belongs to country, uh, belongs to French, makes friendship with Eastern, Western countries and uh, where the country where Person. He's first. Not, not, not one person, Putin, but the people are first, not, not government. So, if I can, the last question: What does uh, when you when you heard about his death, what were you surprised? I was not surprised. I was greatly sad about uh, that it, it, it finally happened. Uh, we knew that it could happen and probably will happen, but when it comes, uh, when it become became like. Your when when I, I just witnessed the history and it's really sad. I I, I think that you can understand when I compare it with uh, when when Kennedy was killed or John Lennon was killed. Uh, for those who love Beatles, it's the same loss for uh, Russia. But, but uh, it's absolutely definitely yes. Can you tell me, can you tell me, I guess, with what's going on in Russia with Ukraine, can you tell me your thoughts on that, sir? Uh, there is ongoing war that Russia began. And uh, it uh, really sucks to feel yourself like uh, from that country who uh, started that war. But it's not about the country. It's not the country started the war. It, it, the war started Putin. And... Uh, it, it, I feel really bad about it because when we, when it happened, uh, we like all my family, all our friends uh, were like really deeply shocked. And we, at first, we couldn't believe that it happened. Uh, then we like really. So it, it was a pain. It was a pain to that you cannot stop that violence. And uh, after two years, it, it, it's ongoing. The conflict is ongoing for two years. We decided that we cannot like cancel it. We cannot stop it by ourselves. But we at least can try to help those who suffer from it. Because some people came uh, to Canada, to Coburg. And that was uh, the primary reason why we tried to, to be more close to uh, guys who some of them are 
our friends now, now and we are trying to help them to, to the extent we could do. Uh, but uh, it's sad, it's not sad, it, it's a pain. It's a pain and uh, it's a double pain when, when I see that uh, some of Ukrainian guys uh, like uh, I can understand why they probably do this and why they do not like Navalny uh, uh, and uh, they put uh, <sighs> piece of bread and kalbasa yeah. uh, <coughs> with a question obviously to me not to him because he's dead but Navalny wanted uh, to stop that war, this war and uh, he was the friend of Ukraine I know that in Ukraine uh, many people just do not like him but uh, I think this is the mistake because if you're <coughs> he was on the same side of barricade with you uh, so he fought fought, 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 fought fought come on Putin and uh, if he wouldn't it would be much worse uh, because uh, in Russia you probably know that uh, there are not only military but paramilitary and lots of Coast Guardia and other uh, troops for internal purposes for and they not on the war they for repressions to, to, to uh, fight against the Russian people and if uh, there were Navalny some of them would be sent to Ukraine so this is part of his work and he fought it from your side.